Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. There are many ways that you can make pixel-based selections in an image. Elements provides you with several tools that you can use to select pixels in an image. You have a set of marquee selection tools, a set of lasso tools, and the magic wand tool. There are also a few commands that we can select from the menu bar that will also allow you to make pixel-based selections. After you make an initial selection, making another selection will typically replace the previous selection. However, we do have some additional selection options that will allow us to add secondary selections to a primary selection, subtract a secondary selection from a primary selection, find the intersection of multiple selections, or find the union of multiple selections. We'll be taking a look at all of those. Once you make a selection, you can move the selected area by simply clicking into the middle of the selection and dragging the selected area to a new location before releasing it. Let's go ahead and try that. We're going to go over to the Tools palette and we're going to select the Quick Selection tool that we'll be examining in an upcoming lesson. Make a quick selection. Go over and click on the Move tool. Then you simply click and drag your selection around. Very easy. We'll go ahead and undo that. Now, to make selections using the menu bar, you can use the Select Menu command. Before you make a selection, you must ensure that you have the appropriate layer of the image selected in the Layers panel. You click on the layer in the panel from which you wish to make a selection. Then you can freely select using the menu bar or one of the tools available in the Tools palette. We'll be talking about layers in the upcoming lessons, and that panel is located over here. In this particular image, we are only working with one layer, which is our background layer. Now, if you wish to select all of the pixels in an image, you can select Select and All from the menu bar. Select All. And you'll see that the selection marquee is around our entire image. Now, to deselect a selection, you simply select Select and then Deselect from the menu bar. And you'll see that it has deselected it. If you're using one of the marquee tools or the lasso tool, you can also simply click one time into the image outside of the selected area to deselect a selection as well. Now you can also select your previous selection that was made by selecting select and reselect from the menu bar. We'll go ahead and undo that. Now, if you make a selection in an image and then wish to select everything except what you had initially selected, then you can choose Select and Inverse to select everything that wasn't selected, excluding the original selection that you made. Let's take a look at that. We'll go back to our Quick Selection tool, and we'll select the entire flower. Then we'll go to Select and then Inverse, and you'll see then where the marquee is in our image and it has now selected all of the pixels other than our original selection, meaning everything outside of the flower. So if we simply click delete on our keyboard, you'll see that we've deleted all of those pixels that were selected. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.